Hi, welcome to Hard Reset Info channel, dear viewers. In front of me is Samsung Galaxy A23, and now I'm gonna show you how to make this device faster. So, first, let's start with the question of why your phone is slowing down. Basically, it's because your phone can't handle to the load you have put on it. This is either because the phone is not powerful enough to do what you want it to do, or because you are not taking good care of your device. You should always understand that every device is designed to perform a certain amount of tasks with a certain dynamic. And not every device can give you the opportunity to work on it smoothly at high dynamic of use. But despite the above, if you follow the instructions I'm about to give you, you will be able to keep your device always in good condition, so that it works at its best. Ok, first aspect – memory. The onboard memory of a device is a limited resource. Often the winner is the one who invests in a device with more built-in memory, and the whole point of the uh, whole point is the device with full built-in memory begins to slow down. It's always a good idea not to fill the built-in memory uh, more than 70% full. So the first step to speed up your device is to free up memory. So to free up memory you can, for example, delete unused apps or upload your uh, photos and videos to the cloud storage and delete from the uh, internal storage. So, first step is deleting unused apps. So, to do it, open your settings, then scroll down and click your apps. Here you will see the list of all your applications. I have installed applications. Uh, okay, I have pre installed Coin Master. Oh my gosh. What the heck? Okay, uh, and Candy Crush Soda. Okay, I want to delete a Candy Crush uh, Saga, for example. So, if you want to delete it too, so open App Info and click Uninstall and Uninstall. Great. With Coin Master, we need to do the same thing. Great. As you can see, we have free up our space. Okay. The second method to free up your space is unloading, uh, unloading, uploading your apps from your, uh, your apps, your photos and videos from your internal storage to the cloud storage. For example, Google Drive, your Google Photos application, gives you 15 gigabytes for free, so 15 gigabytes of the free storage. Uh, you can uh, try. Mega Drive, it gives you uh, 50 gigabytes for free. Just type Mega. Yes, Mega Drive gives you 50, 50 gigabytes for free. Um, and it's really great. As you can see, ProLite costs 5 euros. Um, it's expensive, but but if you want to use 50, uh, 50 gigabytes for free, Mega is good result. Uh, to upload your photos and videos to the cloud storage, just open Photos or Mega Drive, and I will show how to upload in Photos. So just click Allow and click Turn on Backup. Or in or original quality or storage saver, uh, click Skip, and great. Uh, here I see my photos from my Google account, but not from my device. I have no photos in my device, so for example, I will take the photo. Okay, I have taken the photo. I have this photo in my gallery uh, and in my Google Photos. Wait for it. Wait for uploading the photo and now this photo was successfully uploaded to the cloud storage and now I can delete this photo from my gallery and as you can see I have it on my in my Google Photos application. So it not consumes the space of my internal storage but only in the cloud. 
great. Um, so the second aspect that can, that can negatively affect the speed of your device is the lack of RAM. All the process, the processor is running at the moment are running in RAM. All the applications that are running at the moment are also running in RAM. So here again the winners is the one who bought a device with more temporary storage. The RAM can be freed by unloading the running applications or by disabling the background work of the applications. In order to unload the memory of running applications, just swipe your finger up if you, are, you see, if you use gestures or if you use navigation buttons, just click on this three stick button and click close all. Okay, great, my RAM was successfully cleaned. The third aspect that slowed, slows down your device is the files that are left over from running apps. Applications in the Android operation system are literally leaving behind a lot of junk unnecessary files that are not noticeable to the average user of the device and in order to clean these files you will need a special program which will detect these files. Uh, of course you can open settings, you can scroll down um, here choose battery and, uh, battery and device care, click storage and here you will see how many uh, how many megabytes, how much megabytes uh, are uh, consumes of what for example I have uh, audio files for 4 megabytes I have a new device so in my case uh, my my memory is completely clear, but if you need to clean your memory, I suggest to use a completely free application Deep Cleaner. So just find here Deep Cleaner. Deep Cleaner is very simple and it's not working in RAM, so it's not consumes your RAM memory and now it's not slowing down your device. So I suggest to use this device, not Clean Master, not C Cleaner, uh, but on Deep Cleaner. It's completely free. So click Start, Hello. Wait a while, wait a while. Great. As you can see, I have. 600 uh, megabytes of junk files and as you can see 669 megabytes cleaned from my new device. So you need to uh, clean your storage from time to time to take care of your device. Okay, that's it. I hope I was able to help you with this video and if you did then if you did all the steps to clean your device write us about it write us how many how many megabytes you have cleaned with deep cleaner and how many megabytes you have cleaned and uh, you have free up with uh, google photos that's it thanks for watching like this video subscribe to our channel and bye See you!